Okay, boy. I'm joking. What's going on, everybody? And welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, where we left off in the last video. Uh, I, I can't remember. It was yesterday. Anyway, uh, so I got this... Uh, I had this letter from this girl uh, called Mary. And, um... Yeah, uh, this is her house. So uh, this, well, this is where she is at the moment. So I'm just going to head over there and do this mission now. Um, and uh, the poop. So, um, yeah. Uh, there's another mission I have over there. So I might do that today. Really depends. And I got a new hat that I stole from guys that tried to ambush me. Alright. <laughs> Yes? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Hello, Arthur. Mary? I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's, um... Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and come here looking for me is that it no ain't like that Arthur huh. okay listen Arthur I I'm my family I need your help you mean the family that always looked down on me you want me to help it's my little brother Jamie <laughs> I always liked Jamie at least compared to the rest of them He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life. Me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but but I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Yeah, why not? Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Yeah, why not? That's just so maybe the family. Okay. So wait, where are we going? All the way over here. Decent name, I guess. Hey boy. Let's go. So uh, you come here often. Absolute unit. So, uh, yeah, yeah I, I have no idea what to talk about. Um, I guess the game, <laughs> that'd be a good start. So, um, yeah, no, I've kind of been on and off, um, you know, like on and on, like, going on and then you know, doing some sessions and then off. I haven't actually recorded a whole amount of parts um, you know 
like when you see this I'll probably only be like a couple parts ahead like maybe a, well, maybe about five or something ahead not like I was in like other games I don't know why I'm just a bit slower with this game but this game's like a lot longer it's gonna be a lot of videos Uh, this time, there is more than an illusion to fear. It is a fine morning, partner. That was my attempt at an American, an actual American accent. Guess up here uh, I'll unlock a little bit more. What? what? Okay. Brilliant. Alright, let me go around a little bit more. Oh, for God's sake, well, where's the entrance to this fucking hill? Oh, for God's sake. Alright, one second. Let's get back down here. Come on, boy. Oh, yeah, he's got loads of stamina now. Should be able to just run. So that means we must run out.
That should be interesting. Speak to the boy. Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. Oh, He's okay. chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? Um. I'm still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for? Stupidity, <laughs> I guess. Purpose. I don't know. Safety. Safety and meaning. Jamie knows the truth, but of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm. I'm not. I'm not coming with you, Arthur. Just come and speak with Mary. Then make up your mind. Leave me alone, Arthur. I didn't ask for your help. For Christ's sakes, Jamie, just hold up a minute. This is what I did last time. So I have to take desperate measures. Sorry, oh, damn it, I can't catch up with them because it's I said I already scared. Just 
calm down. Leave me alone! What? 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 I warn you, Arthur. I'm. I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. There we go. Calm down. Let's go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Idiot. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. You didn't try to kill yourself. You know... You taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just no, wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. All father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father, a nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. The thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, Dick. Well, um, <laughs> don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. All right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and... What was his name? H Hester? Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. No doubt, but none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. You know Barry Linton's dead? Pneumonia. He told me. So the door's open, so to speak. That's all in the past. Different people now. She's not, and you seem just the same. Well, maybe that right there's a problem. She was always too good for me. Let's just get you back to your sister. She's waiting at the station for us. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Yeah. Dear nurse. 
nervous about seeing her, aren't you? Heard something about the old Driscolls. Jamie! Jamie! Oh, come home! Please! You've... Father's been very sad. My father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Decent, mean, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> How did stop saying decent, mean? I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but. Somehow, I imagine I shall. Alright then, well. There we go. Alright then, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.